What's up guys, it's the Thrifty Sicklu coming at you. I just wanted to do one of my first videos and uh, beginning on a series. One of my favorite fish, the Dovi Cichlid, AKA the Wolf Cichlid. Uh, big fangs, big scary, mean, predatory fish, right? Uh, pretty cool to keep, that's what I thought at first too, you know, but boy are you in for a wild ride when keeping these guys. And that's what I'm doing this video series on. Uh, the cost and the benefit, the joys and the pains of keeping such a large predatory uh, cichlid, such a dangerous aggressive fish to keep in the hobby. Um, it's a single species fish. Uh, you never want to keep this guy with anything else uh, unless you're rich and you're, uh, um, you know, trying to do a Thunderdome, I guess. So don't do that. Okay, so these guys hail from Central America, Honduras, Nicaragua, Costa Rica, Costa Rica, Rica. Costa Rica. So you can find these guys in the trade most often on Aquabid. You know, if you get lucky, probably a local fish store, someone's getting rid of them. But uh, be aware, when you buy these guys, you're not gonna wanna get all of the fry from the same batch. And if you are, like I did, then you're only doing it for the purpose of finding a female, an alpha, a beta, whatever you're trying to look for. Um, and a fish personality to suit your needs at the time, okay? Otherwise, like I said, no need to buy this fish unless you want one fish or you're going to breed them for the purpose of selling them for profit or I don't know what you would do with them. Maybe fill a moat around a castle for your enemies. I don't know. All right, so these guys will grow up to 30 inches guys uh, about 28 30 inches I've seen uh, mine in the past grow up to 26 so these are gonna be huge we're looking at at least 120 gallons for a male and female if you're going to breed them and you're looking at at least a 90 gallon for one single female uh, male or female really uh, I mean point being this is a big fish guys when you buy one of these guys full grown, you're going to invest $220, $500, depending on your budget for a canister filter, sponge filters, things like that. Uh, so you're going to have to think about the money you're going to invest in this fish over the long run, right? Is it worth it? Is it going to be something that you're really going to enjoy uh, 10 years from now? Because these fish <laughs> will live up to 10, 12 years. Um, so it needs to be something you're invested in, something you're willing to do, right? Not just a fish that you're going to keep, oh, it's cool, and then get rid of it here probably in three years once it's too big and you move to another state, right? Uh, so, right, so like I said, three to five of these guys. I bought five, two died, I have left three, one alpha male, I've got one female up there and then another male right here. Sadly, the female up there has beautiful colors, so does he. Um, you know, so he's the beta, that's the female, and then the alpha, that's uh, another part of the video. But, you know, for now, let me show you these guys. I'm about to take them out and put them into a new tank. So don't worry, now that I have, uh, you know, sexed them out and uh, found my alpha male, these guys are going to be finding a new home, probably in the next, you know, I hope, you know, two weeks. But until then, I've got a tank for them, you know, so they are going to be okay. That's another video. watching please like and subscribe if you haven't already if you like what I'm doing and if you want to see more Dovi videos and these guys grow out over the next uh, you know 10 years if YouTube's still around thank you